peace, peace. Think fast. Everything should be about how can this information help me to master my inner universe and to know myself better? How could this information help me to shift my consciousness out of the human moralistic system and realize that, you know, I step into the God that I am, you know? I caught that realization when I thought about, you know, looking at the sun, I'm like, the sun seemed like it's a, a moon and not a sun. Now I went through different aspects. I felt, I caught the vibe of like, you know, us being inside like a, it is a chakra, but like inside like an eyeball in essence. And when the quote unquote sun is out, it's really like a, the eyeball, the part of the eyeball that's allowing light into it. You know what I'm saying? But besides that, you know, again, feeling like, all right, it's a moon. And the reason why it's so bright is because another big ass sun bigger than it is shining this light on it. And then that light reflects onto the moon and kind of like on that mirror to mirror aspect. But, but, but how does that <laughs> help me to be the greatest version of myself? How does that help me to break out of the human moralistic system? How does that help me to, you know, uh, Again, shifting consciousness and master my own inner universe. You know, whatever information we're dealing with, you know, because even again, we're dealing with crystals. How could this crystal help me work on my subconscious? Or you know, how can this crystal help me to, you know, understand my universe to, to more, uh, you know, understand my universe, my inner universe with more clarity? You know, because again, it's about, you know, if we want to use the word saving, you know, if you saving the world, it's about saving your inner world first and foremost, you know, and mastering your inner universe. Because again, whatever conditions we, we find ourselves around and we're looking at with our two eyes, you know, that's because of what's going on inside and our inner eyes projecting, you know, what's going on externally. So again, whatever you're dealing with, just make sure it's about, again, like, self mastery to master yourself and really realize who you are and what your purpose is in this lifetime and you know uh not to just you know learn just to learn and we again a lot of us have gone through that you know vibe of like you know learning all kind of information just to learn but again just application like yeah i could have you know certain knowledge yeah i could be clairvoyant and clear cognizant but it's about applying it to help myself shift and you know in in ascension more so is about again like how can i establish wholeness and balance in my being you know and, and uh how could this crystals are you know again this information help me to be in my moment you know and not just like oh the sun is a moon and then just to go back and forth with somebody oh man the sun is a moon oh i think it's this i think it's that you know how is those conversations going to help you to master your universe and become your greatest version? Now, again, you know, just using that as a little example, but now if you find a way for having that conversation, like having that conversation helps you to understand who you are and master your inner universe, well then, yeah, by all means, you know, step into that realm of it. But again, oh, the earth is flat. The earth is round. Like, how is that going to help me master my inner universe? How is that going to help me program my subconscious to break out of certain habits and break out of certain lesson loops that no longer serve me, you know? Because a lot of times by, even, by going into that information in that miscellaneous type of way, you know, that's the reason why we still going through lesson loops because we're not mastering our inner universe and we're just gaining spiritual knowledge without applying it, you know? So again, it's about application and that's what's been coming up a lot is applying what we know. So, as I just finished speaking on this, I'm about to step back and go learn about myself and, you know, make sure I'm applying all the things that I've been learning on my growth. Like, now is the vibrate, being in the moment. I'm applying that. <laughs> but, <laughs> peace, peace. Happy now. Now is the vibrate, of course. Not too far in the future. Not too far in the past. Right now.